this was inevitable. It wasn't going to get to this mark. The PS4 reaches 70 million. Uh, it's it's really not that surprising to me because, you know, it's just not. And that's attributed to exclusive. Horizon, you know, an exclusive only on the PS4. Uncharted, The Lost Legacy, only on the PS4. And other titles, you know, second, third-party titles. So, when people say exclusives are bad, like the PC trolls, the idiots that say these idiotic things because they hear other idiots that say it without any type of factual backing, they confuse bragging or they don't like the way the person talks about it with anti, which doesn't correlate. Bragging and anti are two separate things. But they're too stupid and brain dead to realize that those are two separate things that have two separate meanings. You get confused and you say idiotic stuff like, you know, exclusives don't help the industry. When these numbers and these articles show that it does. It's just simple, man. The PS4 has the exclusives and it has the second and third party exclusives that go along with it. Destiny with the exclusive, uh, you know, DLC that it has for the PS4. Just an advantage for it. I'm just gonna, you know, let y'all take in the facts because, you know, there's gonna be an idiot in the comment section. Well, well, Neo went over, so... It was not first-party studio. First-party studio games don't go over, you know? Games like Horizon, Uncharted, they're never gonna go over because... They're funded by Sony. It's just that simple. I'm going to just let Epic Sax guy just annoy the shit out of you idiots because there's not much else to say. Oh.